Danny Masterson, known for his role in that 70s show, has received his long-awaited sentence, marking the conclusion of a legal saga that began months ago when he was convicted of two counts of rape. The actor has been sentenced to 30 years in a Los Angeles courtroom. Given that he was found guilty on two of his three counts, the 30-year sentence comes as no surprise. Masterson's conviction on the two counts occurred in May, while the jury was unable to reach a verdict on the third count. These charges date back to incidents alleged to have taken place between 2001 and 2003, during the time he was working on his comedy series. The legal proceedings surrounding Masterson have been marred by delays and complications. Last October, he faced a trial that ultimately ended in a mistrial a month later when the jury could not reach a decision. Despite efforts by the actor's legal team to have the case dismissed, he was retried and subsequently found guilty. Philip Cohen, Masterson's attorney, emphasized that the case hinged on the credibility of the three accusers, asserting that this credibility could only be assessed by scrutinizing the evolving statements made by the women involved. Notably, after his conviction, Masterson was not placed among the general population at the L.A. County Men's Central Jail, where he had been awaiting his sentence. Instead, he was held in administrative segregation, a status previously occupied by high-profile inmates such as O.J. Simpson and Suge Knight. 